Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to solve a particular problem statement using Python. So as you guys can see, I have written down the problem statement on the screen. So let me read it out for you guys. If we list all the natural numbers below 10 that are multiples of 3 or 5, we get 3, 5, 6 and 9. That is 3 times 1, 3, 3 times 5 times 1, 5, 3 times 2, 6 and 3 times 3, 9. And after this, we have been given the sum of these multiples is 23. So when you add 3, 5, 6 and 9, we get the sum that is 23. Now, based on this context, we have been given a small problem statement that, in, that we need to solve. And that is, write a program where it will find all the uh, sum of all the multiples that is of 3 or 5, which is below 1000. So let me just summarize it up. We need to write a program which will find all the multiples of 3 or 5 which are it below 1000. So the way we are going to do it is I have declared a variable called as sum equal to 0 initialized with 0 value at the beginning. And <clears throat> after this I have written a for loop which starts from a range 1 to 1001. So that's basically because we need to even check for the thousandth value. So after this as they have said, we need to calculate the multiples of 3 or 5. So I'm calculating the both separately and storing it in different variables that is multiple of 3. I'm calculating with 3 times the random integer uh, of selected from the list. And after this, I'm doing same for the multiple of 5. And after that, I'm checking with basic simple if statement. So if multiple of 3 less than or equal to 1000 not 1, then we print it that is three times the number being selected from the list and it's multiple and we are converting it to string format so that we don't get any error from python interpreter and after this we are adding the multiple of three being calculated before at line number 14 to the sum so we are adding it that is sum plus multiple of three and after doing it for multiple of three we are going to do it for multiple of five as well so after the loop runs for 1000 times, we come out of the loop and we print the sum. So that is basically how it works. Now let's check out the output, how it works. So type, I'm in my appropriate folder that is pi. And let me just type the file name, python onepy Boom. So here we have the output. As you guys can see, we are printing all the multiples. So which are less than thousand so three times 333 will be 999 so this is less than thousand any number above this will not be accepted so five times 200 must be thousand right so yes so after this it has stopped calculating that means it has over so above the values which go cannot be accepted and cannot be summed to the variable so after adding these multiples that is of three and five we get this particular value. So it is 2,67,333. So that's one simple program that I have written today. So I thought of sharing with you guys. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys liked it, hit the like button, share it with your friends and let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. So if you guys found any errors or bugs or who knows, maybe I have done something wrong. So do let me know in the comment section below. I will see you in the next video. Until then, have a great one.